When we started to think about the new Godan, we actually started by thinking about the city. We thought about the city and we began to think about public spaces in the city and how the street is a very important public space and how you need to create a city that people can walk in, that people can move in with security, that is a city that, that is beautiful. We need people to participate in the same way that they were participating by contributing ideas about the design, how it would work, how they would use it. We now need to participate in realizing it and building it. This project is so much about realizing dreams. It's about pushing those dreams into reality to really make them happen. Our role has been to listen closely to different users, to stakeholders, and also to understand the transforming context in the industrial area. After listening, we started visualizing this, organizing the complex project and shape it into visions, images of a possible future. Collaborating with White from an international perspective has been great because what has been brought in from White is, is a perspective that looks at architecture and urbanism not just from an aesthetic point of view, but from a sociological point of view, from an anthropological point of view, which essentially is acknowledging culture's effects on architecture. Architecture needs to be anchored in its context. It's about the identity of the place, and that has to do with geography, and it has to do with culture. We have based the project concept on an indigenous African village. It has a unique fractal organization, meaning a shape that exists on different scale. The city block, divided into smaller courtyards, leading up to smaller indoor and outdoor spaces. Now, I think the Godan Art Center will be the first of a large arts and culture community and center. Our ambition has been and is primarily to contribute with our engagement, our experience of creating a welcoming and vibrant meeting place in the city, open to everyone. I want the Godan Art Center both to be part of the history of Nairobi, a major icon in itself, in, in terms of its iconography and in terms of its location. So we're hoping to see visitors coming from outside of the capital and even internationally visiting the new Godan. But we're also seeing the Godan as very much a part of Nairobi community.